Hey everyone and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins. On this video we're going to be doing the side quest, Fighting for Fayum. A corrupt Ptolemy commander at nearby Fort Bubastos is extorting grain from Fayum's farmers. Bayek must convince the farmers to help him end the corruption. The commander of a nearby fort has become a new source of oppression for farmers in the Fayum. Bayek, Henut, and Hotefres realize corruption in the area will continue unless they end it. They move to gain the support of Fayum's inhabitants. The reward is 4,500 experience. We need to speak to Hotefres. And he is right where we left him. So we're going to fast travel to Philadelphia. All right, 250 meters. Look at that, you can see Karenese from here. That's kind of cool. I think that's Karenese. <laughs> I just scared him all the way over there. It is true. The soldiers were only the beginning. We have to deal with this commander. We need more information. How far does the corruption go? It may rise as far as Ptolemy's inner circle. We cannot trust any Philakitai. We cannot do it alone. We need Fayum. Most of the farmers will not talk for fear of the soldiers. But they are angry. It will not take much to convince them. Let me talk to that farmer the captain was threatening. I will spread the word. Okay, speak to the farmer. He's 190 meters that way. To the east. Whoa. Oh, sorry, horse. Zeni. I saw what happened with the soldiers. Nebet Khenu took a big risk. I appreciate what she did, but it won't change anything. I'm sorry, but I must keep working. I've got a stack of fires to light. Let me help then. Ooh, starting fires. That's something I'm good at. What are you doing? Lighting your fires. You don't give up, do you? I will ensure your crops are fertile, Sammy. Hey, what are you doing? She got herself on fire. Well, I don't have any water. Stop dropping a roll. Or, or stand there. There you go. Well, you didn't burn to death. That's good. All right. Well, she's kind of dumb. Good. Run away. You're gonna hurt yourself. There you are. It is time to rise up against the soldiers. Hotefres will fight with you. Hotefres? He abandoned us long ago. His father was a good man. He gave his son an Egyptian name. We loved him for that. But he could not give him an Egyptian heart. Hotefres means satisfied in our tongue. But he never was. He soon left us to the hyenas and crocodiles. Yet crocodiles may still be defeated. The captain is no more. Rise, Seni. Spread the word. You defeated the captain? Wow. You are a madman. Okay. If you are willing to do this, I will join you. I will spread the word, Seni. All right. Gonna get that farmer support. Speak to Hotefres at the Philadelphia farm. His place is ridiculously nice. You should invite me over more often. Nope, you gotta climb that bike. Climb. There you go. No, that's not climbing. Try it again. There you go. 
I did not know things were this bad. I mean, I knew there was trouble, just not like this. This is my fault. I did not want the responsibility here in Fayum. The inheritance was forced on me. I wanted to stay on my ship, the adventure. Now, I realize. Giving up is a choice. And I am still alive. They must be in the villa. Take the back. You, come with me. Soldiers! Where are you, Malakia? Come down. Oh, we need a talk. Looks like the choice has been made for me. Come, brother. Let us talk to them. With our swords. I have got your back. And it is good to have you back, brother. Be careful, Hotefres. They were shaking their hips and doing squats. They mean business. Rush in and die, you dogs! He's got a sword! Take him! Your mistake. Haha, <laughs> I interrupted you. You don't get to talk, you just get to die. Watch out, Hotefres! Oh, we almost ate that. Hey, you fight well for someone retired. <laughs> I am not old yet, Siwan. I can see that. But it will not be enough. The soldiers will come in greater numbers now. I inherited more than a strong sword arm. I will hire a private army if I need to. I might have a better idea. Bayek, could you accompany me on a short journey? Uh, let me get the shinies first. Now I will accompany you. I'm ready. Let's go. You two make a good team. Hotefres has lost none of his fire. You sound proud of him. <laughs> it is nice to have back the man I married. Where are we going? There is a rebel camp nearby. It is to the east of here, by Fort Bubastos. We are going to meet with them. Rebels? Oh. We're dealing with them, not Andy Raff of Alexandria. Alexandria is no stranger to intrigue, Magi. Favors are sometimes traded for information or protection. Such alliances are necessary if not officially acknowledged. Well, we had some troubles getting through town. People on the road, like normal. Can't walk on the sides. Gotta be sh right in the middle. Makes no sense. Hey, there's a crocodile. Well, I guess I could help. Well, actually, I don't want to bug my quest out. Sorry, you're on your own. This game has lots of bugs. I was saying. It didn't even stop. Jeez, get lectured either way. New region discovered. Harris Gnome. This way. Their camp is just up ahead. Whoa. We should be cautious. Rebels are not known for their hospitality. I sent word. They are expecting us. I am Henut. I sent word from Philadelphia that we were coming. We need your help. You wasted your time. Sorry, we cannot help you. We are not asking for charity. We can offer food, supplies, and information. All we require in return is protection for our people. I said we cannot help. Soldiers captured our leader down at the dam. Then perhaps we can help you. This is Bayek of Siwa. You are Bayek of Siwa? We were told what you did at the arena. Beating the Gallic brothers like a madman. And I suppose today, I play the madman again. I like your swagger, Bayek. Not bad, not bad. Okay, we need to rescue the leader of the Fayum rebels. He's down at the dam. But before I do that... I'm gonna take out this camp over here. We're really gonna make these rebels impressed. This is Cleon's Wharf. We got a dude there.
captain down there. They got a fire, although I'm not going to let them light that. And that's good enough. I've got sleep dots. We don't have to be too sneaky. You there. Stop. Oh, shut up. I, like rapid fired those. You can sleep too. Alright, we got a guy down there, and then we have the captain. And I believe that's it. Alright, enemy is taken care of. This will complete the location. 600 experience for that. Well, I'll take it. Definitely a little much though for like six guys. Right, I'm getting some sleep dots and we're moving on. So the dam doesn't have many enemies either, so I'm not going to bother marking him. They're all obvious. Nobody really skulking around. <laughs> Commendation from the Nomarch of Fayum. By the grace of Ptolemy, the father-loving god, and your hard work, this dam now stands resolute against the desert. Millions depend upon Fayum's farms, and Fayum's farmers depended upon you. You prevailed, and I commend you for your efforts. Prosperity for all, culture for all, security for all. Alright, I think my captain's up there. There's another guy over there. Yep, there's the captain. See, that guy's not moving. Let's trap up the fire just in case. You never know. Okay, I don't think we have any goodies over here. But I know there's some down here in the water. However, one of these is bugged, so you can only loot up two of these. So that one you can. This one's bugged. That one you can get. Oh, I think that guy was trying to get to me. Oh, he served as a good distraction. Uh, I think he got himself beached. Oh, well, not worried about him. He did it to himself. Go, now. Thank you. Who are you to attack soldiers so openly? Don't you fear waking Greece? I am Bayek of Siwa, and I am more afraid of Egypt sleeping. You crazy Siwan! My men spoke of you! Fighting in the arena single-handed like a madman. Nick! They told me dogs have no chance if you're on our side. And I will need you on my side when it matters. <clears throat> the 
The way back from here is clear. Before you go, I need a favor. Henut is waiting at your camp. She will ask for your help to protect our people. I owe you my life. You have my word, it will be done. Would you also tell her I go to Fort Bubastos? I have business with the commander there. Alone against a fortified garrison? Are you crazy? Perhaps. I am Bayek of Siwa. My legend grows. It's about to grow more. Because we need to assassinate the commander of Fort Bubastos. Let's get it done. Sounds like a crowd protesting. People are gathering outside the fort. Alright, this is a big fort. And we're gonna try to get as many guys marked as possible. along the walls. We got a bunch in this building over here. Two captains. I believe one of them's a commander, but whatever. Two leaders. Got a signal fire. More guys. No one along that wall, surprisingly. Alright, well, I suppose that's good enough. So let's get started. <laughs> I scared the protesters. Well, they appear to be back, protesting at an empty gate. Right, how do we want to do this? He's in sight of these two. Good. Breakthrough. Chain assassinate. Got him. Gotcha in the foot. <laughs> okay, one captain down. And somehow that guy didn't hear me at all. Hey, what? Okay, this tunnel will lead into the fort, but I'm not going to take it in. I'm just going into this room to get a bunch of goodies. I got some iron. Nice. Anyone up there? Don't see anyone. That guy's heading back into the fort. That guy appears to be coming out. Let's go get the guy up here first. Alright, so you're gonna want all your sleep darts for this. So, I'm stocked up, that's good. We're gonna grab this right here, and then be ready. As soon as we go in, we're gonna try to get the captains right away. So we have him and the other one over there. Ah! 
We've got rebels here. All right. Voices. Someone else is attacking the fort. Seems all of Fayum has turned against the commander. All right. So the fastest way to help them is to sleep people and then kill them and then chain assassinate. Someone was going for the fire. Who was it? Him. Not going to happen, buddy. So just try to keep the rebels alive as much as you can because they're help for you. Haha, -ha, I gotcha. I might need to go get a quiver. Well, no, I just picked up two more sleep darts. I'll probably be okay. Oh, he needs some help over there. He probably needs some help. I'm coming. I want you guys alive. Ah, fine. We'll just beat him up. Lay off of him. Chain assassinate. Gotcha. All right, it's going pretty well. Now that captain up there, he is mean. So be careful with him. All right, he's dead. Who else we got? He's going for the fire. That's not going to happen. There's my target. Target's down. That is the end of his corruption. I should keep the others. Oh, getting hit from someone. Who's shooting me? Is it that guy? Die. Alright, gotta be careful with my health here. It's getting a little low. I've got one sleep dart left. I gotta be careful with that big guy in there though. Ah! Get out of there! It's hard to see. Alright, here we go. Stun him up. Oh, walked right into that! That didn't feel good. Alright, he's dead. How's that big guy doing? I actually got him at half health. That's not too bad. Alright, um. I don't know if I'm ready to go for him just yet. I suppose I could. All right, let's go. Oh! All right, let's drag him outside. I don't want to fight him in there. Oh, crap. He's got a friend. All right, hold on. Let's do this at a distance. Ha-ha! <laughs> well, if I can take this guy down at range, that would be ideal. Because he is nasty, but I don't think that's really going to work. Although it is staggering him. Alright, that's not gonna work. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is use my new... Oh wait, what's going on here? Use my new fancy uh, attack and push. And it'll do a bunch of attacks. It won't actually knock him down, but that's not what I want. I just want those extra attacks. To kill him that much quicker. And we can overpower kill him. Time to die. All right. We actually kept a rebel alive. It's a bit surprising. All right. I think we killed everyone, or at least most of them. That guy lived. Oh, that must have went right over his shoulder. Alright, I know there's uh, a quiver over here, so I'm gonna go grab that. Then we got a whole bunch of stuff to pick up. Oh, and I, you know what I should have done? I probably could have jumped on one of those uh, mounted crossbows and just laid into a bunch of dudes. But, oh well, too late now. All right, so this is a big fort. There's probably some guards that didn't even know there was a fight going down. And there's definitely going to be a lot of goodies to pick up. The reason I was being so careful with that big guy is because he can one-shot me. And I didn't want him to get a lucky hit. So I was just trying to play it a little safe with him. Oh, and he's a rebel. He was about to get sleep darted. 
Uh, is that a quiver over there? Probably. Yep, yeah, that's just a quiver. I suppose I should trap that fire just in case. So let's go ahead and do that. So yeah, I'm really enjoying that new attack and push. Mostly for the enemies you can't push, strangely enough, just because it gives extra attacks that are super quick. Let you take down harder enemies a lot quicker. So I'm enjoying it for that. I've not used it for pushing at all. And this got 200 drachma and a legendary trinket. That's pretty sweet. Hunter bow. Some stuff there. Definitely some things in here. Looks like they're above me. All right, so we got two treasures here. Still have two more to find. Let's see, let's go out this way. Found a quiver up there. Another 200 drachma. We're definitely going to have 100 trinkets now for that one trophy. Next time I sell to a merchant. That guy's still alive. We'll take care of him. He's a coward. He stayed out of the fight. But it did not save him. Oh, never mind. He must have came in late. He had 30 bronze. Must have been driving a chariot. Hard leather, I'll take that. Alright, what else do we got? I think it's all in here. Well, I think the rebels were outnumbered. And they all died but one, but we did clear the ford, so I think uh, you could technically call that a success. Carbon crystal. We got some goodies up here. Location complete. 1500 experience. Jeez. Let's see. Am I going down here? Oh. An enemy. Ow. Alright, where am I? I'm all turned around. We can help civilians. Let's do that. My last letter. My beloved. This will be my last letter to you. I'm dying and there is no hope I will ever be released from this cell. I love you and it breaks my heart that I will never see you again. Thank you for loving me and for everything you have ever done. Don't be sad. Live your life and find happiness. Only remember that I loved you. Pray for me that the gods find me worthy to walk in the field of reeds. Sorry for the state of my writing. There is almost no light here, and the brush and ink they gave me are barely usable. My hand also shakes constantly. Farewell, my le or farewell, my wife. I take your love with me to the duat, Pentu. All right, civilians are freed. Whoever that was didn't make it, unfortunately. And that's the room I raided earlier. So, I left at least one enemy alive because he was about to attack me. And I think there's still a few treasures in this building. Yeah, they appear to be above me. How do I get there? Up here? Oops. I don't know who saw me. Ah, here we go. Those up there are quivers, so I think we're done. Eh, whatever enemy that was, I don't care. So we need to speak to Hotefres and Henut outside Fort Bubastos.
It is done. You had help. The farmers staged a protest to distract the soldiers. They were fearless. The rebels also did their part. You've inspired them, Bayek. In truth, they are in awe of you. Our farms will be well protected. They love their crazy sea one. They won't let another crocodile plague the Fayum again. Your people are free now. It is a good start. Otifres, it is time to live up to your name. And my duty as a husband. Shadia liked you immediately, you know. You always have a home here, if you need it. All right, and another 4,500 experience gets me almost halfway through 37, and I got Shadia's doll back. Okay, uh, we're near another location. We may as well go do it. I think there's a road right here. Well, maybe not. There's a road down below. And oh, never mind, this is the road. New location discovered, Metalon Docks. Now there are some soldiers in here. Right there. I should be cautious around here. However, they are not paying nearly enough attention. Oops, I didn't mean to carry him. Put him down. And that completes this location. It's an easy one. Although there are a few guards down below, I believe. I could take them out really quick. Let's see. Or maybe not. Thought there were. Okay, never mind. So, we're done in this particular area. Let's go back to Philadelphia. Then we'll go to that sink point. We'll hit that location and then that location over there. So, mark that one. Here we go. Those guards will be pissed off if I get close. So, we'll come over here. Oh. Not trying to climb trees, bike. Not those trees, at least. Hello, horse. Get out of the There was some stuff here. Ah, there's something to read up top. A farmer's poem. Philadelphia. Mound of grain and gold. A pile of shit, if the truth be told. I like that poet. He's got a certain way with words that appeals to me. We've got location there. Yes. Oh, horse, why'd you break the fence? Well, since you started it. Oh, and you jumped that one, of course. 
Wait, what was that? Whoa. Oh, dead bird. A bloated corpse. Fayum is doomed. All of us farmers will be out of jobs by the end of the year. So I've been thinking, and I've decided to be an explorer instead. This is so exciting. It beats the mundane boredom of farming, that's for sure. I should have done it years ago. I'm going to start with the cave I used to go to with my brothers when we were children. But nicked. It's flooded this time of the year. Never mind, I'll just be careful. I don't think that quite worked out for him. I think there's an alligator or crocodile around here, but I don't actually see it. Oh wait, I hear one. Where is it? I got attacked last time and I don't want that to happen again. So where is he hiding? Oh, he's right there. Plus I need the skin anyway. Or the leather, I mean. All right, we should be safe to go down. Don't see any other crocs? If I do, I'm getting out of this water quick because I am not fighting them in the water. If I'd even make it out of the water. All right, location complete. Pretty sure I got everything. Alright, uh, yeah, let's keep going north. Northwest. And we'll use one of these boats. This one will work. That's a crocodile. Keep on paddling. Don't fight him out here. I I really don't see any way you survive on this difficulty if your boat gets sunk by a crocodile or a hippo or really anything. They just do way too much damage. I don't see any way you're gonna live. Unless you're not using the enemy auto level and maybe they're like super low level, then you might have a chance. But even then, I don't know. You're in their territory. Alright, we're at the whatever trireme wharf. <laughs> Can't pronounce that one. There's the captain. Got a building of supplies. Actually, quite a few enemies here. Might have to be somewhat careful. However, a decent amount of them are asleep, so that'll help. We'll start with this guy at the entrance. Uh, they will attack on sight here. Uh, and then we should probably get rid of the sleeping guys. There's about six of them. Packed area. You're sleeping in your bed. You expect your uh, you expect your fellow soldiers to be keeping watch for you, and some assassin comes in and kills you. That guy's actually by himself. May as well get him now. Wait a second. Ooh, right in the face. That couldn't have felt good. So he probably wasn't feeling anything for very long. Oh, I picked up a bunch of guys on the trireme. There's actually not that many here. In fact, that might be all of them. Uh, no, there's one guy over there. We'll get him in a minute. 
Get out of there. Okay, I believe that's everyone. Let's see, how do I climb up there? Guess let me just do it this way. And then drop in. Interesting layout. Oh, never mind, there is a... There is an opening in the ceiling, I just didn't see it. Okay, I think the stuff in the tent is all we have left. Got a blue spear, location complete. And yeah, I think that's everything. Okay, that's enough locations for now. Let's go do an arena boss, the slaver. Okay, arena event, the slaver. A furious giant with a massive weapon. The slaver is a man mountain of angry, mindless brawn. Entering the arena! He enslaves each entrance of the flashback! The slaver Cassandros! Alright, so this guy's actually not that bad. He's much easier than the Gallic Brothers. Plus, I have that fancy new, uh, what's it called? Attack and push. And it works quite well, as you'll see right here. Oh, but it didn't stagger him. Alright, also, uh, Shield Bash does work on him. So you can use that. Watch me! And, uh, yeah, just keep plugging away at him. Obviously, don't get hit by his big attacks. Uh oh. Just got a little too aggressive there. Let's bash him. Oh, I don't know what happened with my camera there. That was a little weird. So you can see my, uh, attack and, uh, push does drain adrenaline, though. Now, one thing I would like to do, I haven't managed this in practice, but I didn't really try, to be honest, is I do want to try to... Oh! Not walk right into his big attacks would be a good start. Um, I do want to try to finish him with an overpower, because there's a trophy for that. Let's see, he's going to lunge. Watch out! So yeah, I'm going to try to gain adrenaline and just kind of stay near high adrenaline so I can finish him with an overpower, but he doesn't really do anything too scary. He will at 50% get some new attacks, but nothing crazy. Alright, overpower's ready. Alright, used up a little adrenaline doing that. Which is fine, I'd planned on it. Get some adrenaline back right here. Doesn't get as much adrenaline back as I would like. Now if he catches you with one of those lunging things he, he does, um, he'll throw you and if you happen to be, whoop, if you happen to have a spike track uh, behind you, he'll throw you right into the spike trap. He's actually being really easy though. He usually does his lunge stuff way more often. So I don't know why it's being so simple, but I'm cool with it. I bash you! Oh, the bash didn't work! Get out of there! Alright, so... Let's just keep working on him. Get him low health, and then get ready for that overpower. Maybe one more combo will get him low enough? I think so. One more combo. Get away from it. He's got to leave himself more open than that, though. Oh! Oh, he got me with that one. He's going to toss me. Metro. 
Oh, crap. <laughs> well, this is not going so well at the moment. Overpower! Hopefully that's good enough. Yes! No mercy! He didn't show any mercy to the guy before me, so he got none. So I got Fatality for finishing him with an overpower, and then I got uh, the other trophy for those about to die for finishing all of the Crocodilopolis Arena events. Which is a little confusing because I'm about to unlock a new one. Well, I guess they aren't technically new, but uh, the arena elite events, uh, elite events, we've got elite events for the brothers and the slaver. I haven't done them yet. Don't know how much harder they are, um, but we'll be doing them soon. Oh, and I also got a new outfit for completing the events. So let's get out of here. Okay, let's check out the new stuff. Got new gear. Lots of new bows. All blue though. Oh wait, got some purple ones there. Uh, well, we have a duplicate mute bow, so let's go ahead and break that down. Two iron. We got a new outfit. Let's put that on. It's the dress of the coastal realm. Life at sea can be hard, and it's even harder without the right clothes. Nine plus melee weapons. We got the Sea People's Blade. Break that down. The Canaanite Blade. Um, yeah, break that down. A shower. This is new. This enchanted mace, whose name means Smasher of Thousands, was once wielded by Ninurta, a Mesopotamian god. Break that down. We care not for the god's weapons. And then we have Needle. Let's break that down. Okay, but we don't get to craft anything new. Oh, we do have shields, though. Ah, the Aegean Prince. We can break that down. But still nothing new. Inventory, we have Shadia's doll. We've seen that before. And that is everything. There's the new outfit. It's fancy. I actually really like it. I think it looks really good. The legs are a little weird. I don't, I'm not a big fan of the legs. Um, but other than that, I really like it. Alright, we're done here. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.